Hey guys, same Princess here. So today I really wanted to talk about Frieza and because we all know that he's coming back to Dragon Ball Super in episode 93 because Goku is going to go to recruit him for the Tournament of Power because somebody fell asleep. <laughs> but we'll get to that in another video. <laughs> anyway, I'm pretty sure you guys know who I'm talking about by now. So basically, you guys know already that I'm not happy with Frieza coming back and stuff, so I won't get into that. But I just want to talk about what we can expect from Frieza um, now that he's coming back again <laughs> and stuff like that. I mean, there are maybe some reasons that we don't know about. We just assume things right now because, you know, Frieza is a villain. He has come back before, um, you know, with a new power and stuff. So like with a new form and things like that but there might be reasons that we don't know about that Toei only does of course because they don't reveal everything to us just bits and pieces here and there and some really big bombs like this but um, <laughs> you know they don't reveal everything to us we can just assume from now on until we actually see the episode in a in like two episodes we will see it so <laughs> Hey, so next one's 91, 92, and then 93 when Goku goes to recruit Frieza, so... Oh my god, okay, so let's get into it. So what I really um, think that Frieza... So if if Goku goes to recruit Frieza, I mean, we know that he will, but when he does, I think it's going to be really, like, awkward. I mean, Goku's going to be like, Hey, Frieza, you want to join the Tournament of Power with us? <laughs> You know, join the team and stuff like that. So, I mean, he's going to be all happy duply, probably. Or he might be serious and be like, you know, we need you for this tournament or whatever. Like, he just might either be serious or happy, <laughs> okay, about this. Although knowing Goku and, you know, him sometimes like scratching his head like this and being all innocent and stuff might happen. <laughs> Although we might see him have that serious face on, so... Who knows? But I think it might be a bit awkward and Frieza will be like, you know, what are you doing down here? I'm surprised you're visiting or stuff like that. Like, um, oh, I just re re received a message. Okay, how lovely. Um, <laughs> but, um, you know, I just think they'll be really awkward a bit at first. Um, especially because, of course, everyone else is going to disagree with Goku's decision to do this. And, of course, there are legit reasons because Frieza has been uh known to cause a lot of destruction before and um you know and he has i understand why they're bringing him back kind of because he has close ties with the other characters like with vegeta you know vegeta spent most of his life with frieza and um you know there's that whole grudge with the saiyans and stuff like that and they tried to destroy namek and earth before back in the frieza saga and dbz so there are many ways that he kind of connects with all the characters, with Krillin, with Goku, with Gohan, with everybody really, with Piccolo, so he has a lot of connections with the characters. That's why I think they brought him back and not Cell or anyone else really. Um, although I still don't like it, it doesn't matter, <laughs> I still don't like that. I mean, Frieza is, uh, is an okay villain, he's pretty powerful, but uh, I really do not like that they brought him back. It's just like, oh my god, guys, seriously? <laughs> Sometimes it looks like just bad writing to me, right? But it doesn't, doesn't matter. Yes, I am wearing my Goku Freezer shirt that I'll leave a link to in the description down below so you guys can get it out, get it, get it out, get it for yourselves if you want it. But, um, you know, um, the other thing is that Freezer, at the moment of hearing that Goku wants him to join this tournament, he might immediately get some bad uh, thoughts. You know, because he might team up with other fighters to destroy Goku. Who knows what will happen here, right? I mean, there are, of course, positives for char for other characters um, that Frieza's coming back. Like, for example, Frost, which I talked about in another video. Um, but, uh, you know, Frost might achieve a new form. Maybe his golden form, like golden Frost, might happen because of Frieza. Because we know that Frieza will probably turn golden some time during the tournament um so you know frost might see this power and then might just explode once you know while fighting someone and just might explode all this power and like go golden on us 
but that's the only positive that I see honestly because like I mean it does make the team of universe six more powerful but there's a that's a villain right and villains are capable of many things especially if they come back with new forms which I hope Frieza does not <laughs> to be honest because we've just seen a lot of forms from Frieza no okay but we might see a bit more evolved form of the golden like he's more powerful or something like I don't know how that would happen because he's in hell and surrounded by cutesy little creatures and stuff like that which is probably going crazy in his mind like that but um but uh you know um I just feel like he would turn on them right at the beginning like he might just get oh I get to come back to earth again it's just for 24 hours, but I get to come back to Earth. So he has a lot of time to think of something bad to do, right? Especially with the Super Dragon Balls there and you'd be able to grant any wish. So who knows? I just hope that nothing happens completely to bring him back full time because I would be pissed off to do that, okay? Just no, I'll just stop watching Super then. <laughs> I'll probably not, but still, just no. Um... But like, you know, I'm sorry to all the Freezer fanboys out there. I know you're probably really hyped that Freezer's coming back. And I don't sort of blame you, but I don't like it. It's just my opinion, okay? But, um, and, you know, it's just, um, I just feel like we can expect a lot of bad things from Freezer. Because, like I said before, he has known to cause a lot of bad things happening here, right, for the destructions and stuff like that, so I really don't know what the hell is going on in Goku's mind, he's going cuckoo, <laughs> okay, but uh, like, no, we just don't know all the reasons that Toei does and Toriyama, so hey guys, I'm open to whatever you guys have to say about this in the comments down below, um, you know, just leave me your comments, leave me your, leave me your thoughts, let me know what you think about Frieza coming back, what you expect from him, what kind of character do you think he'll be? Do you think that he'll flip a switch and suddenly be good? Or <laughs> or do you guys think that he'll be like all crazy again and think of something bad to do immediately? Because these are villains, okay? And villains have a sp specific role in anime, right? Or it's really rare that villains turn back, uh, turn to good to the good side and stuff. You, you guys know what I'm saying. Like, it's rare that that happens. Um, especially in Dragon Ball Z. So, um... <laughs> but, uh, you know what I mean. Just leave me a comment down below in the comments. Let me know what you guys think about this. Everything that I've said here and Frieza coming back. What are your opinions? What do you expect? Um, and let me know if you think that Frost will achieve his golden form, finally, and stuff like that. So, um... Yeah, but maybe like Frieza will train Frost or something like that will happen, but uh, we don't know fully. So uh, just like I said, leave me a comment down below. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you're new, please subscribe. I do um, reactions to Dragon Ball Super. I do sometimes unboxings if I get cool figures. I do discussions like this on characters and what's going on in Dragon Ball Super. Sometimes I put up spoilers for Dragon Ball Super too, but if you guys don't want to watch that, I totally understand. But again, thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!